class for town and country disposal night friday night dirt track racing here at the rapid speedway one and only heat race for the sportsmen coming to the green flag and flag man cody johnson at the ready he'll give them the sign and we are underway Scotty too honey a little off the pace on the front row there he'll go from the front to the back ran endurance up on the front row he will lead uh, so far here in lap number one. Here comes the 14 machine. Brian Crow taking a peek inside. Nothing happening there on the outside. Highline is the number 50 of Roger DeBoer looking for the early race lead. He'll make the fast kick. Roger DeBoer, your race leader, from fifth to first in one lap time for the number 50 machine. Roger DeBoer, Brandon Durance, Brian Crow, Rick Heeman, and a side-by-side -side battle for a top five spot. Here in the heat race, Brian Lawson outside, Leon Stiller down low. Brian Crohn working on Brandon Jurens for that second spot to the outside. Brian Crohn moving into that second position. Brandon Jurens back to third. Roger DeBoer, your race leader up and squarely topside at turns one and two. Brian Crone will assume the race lead. Brandon Jurens moving up into that second spot. And with a bullet, here comes the 14 K of Brian Clawson. Brian Clawson looking to get into the top three as Brian Crone, your new race leader in the 14 machine. Brian Crone, the 50 of Roger DeBoer, the 19 Brandon Durance, the 14 K of Brian Clawson, and the 44 of Leon Stiller, your top five on the track. One and only heat race for the sportsman class here tonight at the Rapid Speedway. A town and country disposal night. Brian Crone, your race leader. As Crone continues to lead, Roger DeBoer hanging on to that second spot. That big boy racing number 50 machine. 14K of Brian Lawson in third. Looking at the inside of DeBoer for his second position. Nice turn into turn number three for Brian Lawson. He'll take over that second spot for the time being. White flag is out for your race leader, Brian Crone. Brian Crone, Brian Lawson, Roger DeBoer, Brandon Durans, and Leon Stiller, your top five, and the Zorick running top side. In the white number nine machine, moving into that fifth spot on the outside of Leon Stiller. Heat race victory will go to the 14, Brian Crone. Brian Crone with a heat race win. Brian Clawson coming home in second. Roger DeBoer in third. Brandon Jurens in that fourth spot. And Andy Wazor got his way to the top five after he cleared the crowd. Cody Johnston, green flag and hand ready to go here. A feature starting the night here with our sportsman class. First day feature of the night, town and country disposal night here at the Rapid Speedway. Head flag man Cody Johnson gives them the sign, and we are green flag racing. Sportsman Class A feature, our first day feature of the night. Brandon Jurens off to the early race lead. That big boy racing number 50, Roger Moore. Here comes through the middle, Brian Lawson. In the 14 k machine, looking for a piece of that race lead. Down low, looking solid. In the 14 k it's Ryan Lawson for the race lead. Ryan Lawson from fourth to first, taking over the race lead in the 14 k Brandon Jurens holding up at the number 19 in that second spot. Here comes Andy Wazorek. Andy Wazorek at the number nine, up to that third position. Working on to the inside, and Jurens for second spot. And looking for a queen sweep up to the lead. Number nine of Andy Wazorek to the inside of Brian Lawson. Wazorek and Lawson one to do. Roger DeVore in third, and here comes Brandon Jurens back top side. Looking for that third spot. He's got it to the outside of the floor. Great battle going on for position here in the Sportsman 80 feature tonight. Brian Lawson, your race leader. 
Oh, Boston around in front of Wazork and the rest of the field. A little bit of contact with the 50 of the board, but for the most part, everybody is through okay. I did not see from my vantage point if there was an assist or not. Andy Wazork, your present race leader, Sportsman A feature here tonight at the Rapid Speedway. Coming up next, the SLMR late model b feature next up to take the track at the rapid speedway first our sportsman a conclusion and he was already here race leader but Zorik with the race lead and it looks like brandon jurens will follow that line into that second spot brian crone along for the ride as well with the number 14 in the third position oh we got up and off the track looks like ryan clausen up and off the track Leon Stiller off the track as well, and the caution will come out once again here in the Sportsman A feature. That flag man Cody Johnson at the ready. He will give them the sign this time by, and we will resume a feature racing for the Sportsman class. Brian Crone taking a peek down low. Andy Wazorek still rolling in the number nine machine. Brandon Jurens in the number 19 in that second spot. Crone running in third position. Marty DeBoer, Roger DeBoer rounding out. The or top five as Andy Wazorek continues to lead. Fourth from class A feature here tonight. At the Rapid Speedway, a lot of great racing to go yet. We've got a couple of great last chance qualifiers for the SLMR late models. We've got our Audi A, our Beamon A, our Stock Car A, and our late model A all still to come here tonight at the Rapid Speedway as Egan pulls off and retires for the night in the one even team out of Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Rick Egan has retired from the race. Andy Wazorek stretching out that lead. Brandon Jurens hanging tough. In that number 19 machine holding on the second spot. Brian Crone's got him under attack in the number 14. Crone waiting to make the move that'll work or possibly waiting for Jurens to give him an entry. Andy Wazorek, meanwhile, likes what he sees behind him and continues to pull away. Well, if he could look behind him. Andy Wazorek, your race leader. In the number nine machine. Still getting used to that thing with stickers. With Zorik, Jurens, Crone, DeBoer, and Clawson. That would be Marty DeBoer in the fourth position. And Brian Clawson in the fifth spot. After all the early race drama, Brian Clawson has rallied his way back into fifth position here in the Sportsman 8 feature. Andy Wazorek with the race lead. Brandon Durance. Here comes Ryan Crone. Crone looking down low off the exit of two and down the back stretch. Durance still too strong up on the top side. Brandon Durance through the middle looking a little low to put the block on the 14. And he will complete that block. White flag is out for Andy Wazorek. Andy Wazorek, Brandon Durance, Ryan Crone, Marty DeVore, and Ryan Lawson, your top five. Crone looking for one last shot for second spot. Durance closes the door. Off we headed to turn number three. Crone taking the peak down low. Durance down low will pitch him. Andy Wazorek will take home the A feature win. Andy Wazork will make his second trip to Victory Lane for the 2017 season. Second place they'll go to Brandon Jurens, the number 19 car, then Brian Crone, Marty DeBorn, and Brian Clawson rounding out your top five. Andy Wazork making his way here into Victory Lane performance graphics on the side of that number nine machine. Michaela Lang out to present the trophy. She's got a trophy of her own.